All right, joining us now on the show is friend of the Racing Boys. You can see some in-car uh, video from his win down at uh, the Jesse Hockett Daniel McMillan M- Millen Memorial on uh, RacingBoys.com. Wayne Johnson joins us now. Hey, Wayne, how you doing, bud? Hey, Scott, doing good. How about yourself? Congratulations, brother. I didn't get a chance to talk to you after the race the other night, but uh, fantastic job beating one of the great legends of all time in sprint car racing. you got to feel good, not only about the win, the $10,000, but beating a guy like Sammy. Nah, for sure. You know, anytime you can beat Sammy or it's Steve or, you know, those guys have been doing it for a long time or uh, whatever, you know, those they, uh, you know, they got all those tricks up their sleeve. They know what you're going to do normally uh, before you do it. So uh, to get one over on one of those guys, you know, it's a big deal. Yeah. Wayne, we're, we're short on time, so I want to let you uh, finish up with this. The magnitude of that event, obviously, when you won that $50,000, that fall brawl up there, that was maybe your biggest victory. I'm sure the, uh, financially, maybe your biggest victory ever. But when it comes to marquee events like, say, 360 Nationals, it doesn't compare to anything else. That's that's its own thing, right? But if you look at Jackson Nationals, Short Track Nationals, uh, a lot of these other races, where would you rate the Jesse Hockett, Daniel McMillan Memorial? I know it's special to you because your relationship with Jesse, but at, for 110 cars to be there with two classes, just talk about the magnitude of that event and where it is on the upper echelon of races that you go to. Three minutes. Three. Well, I would have to say that it's probably as big as the 360 Nationals or the Short Track Nationals or, mm-hmm. or any of those places. You know, uh, the turnout has become, you know, bigger and bigger and bigger every year. And, uh, you know, we, we're we drawing the best cars. You know, we're getting Sammy Swindell, for, you know, for, for right. instance, to be there. And, uh, you know, and it's a beautiful facility for sure. And they do a great job. You know, they they really changed the racetrack around here in the last couple of years. Uh and uh, we're doing a fantastic job with the racetrack. But, uh, you know, it's right there. I mean, it has to be. You know, it pays just as much as uh, most of those places pay anymore and probably going to end up, you know, growing and getting to pay more because of uh, the, the turnout that we're getting. But, 